Hi, I'm Rupali Datta and I'm a clinical nutritionist. Today I'm going to speak about vegetarianism. The world over vegetarianism is picking up in a great way because of the benefits of plant food that come into our meals. In India we are very familiar with the concept. Majority of our population believes in eating vegetarian food. Even the ones that take non-vegetarian food, there's a large quantity of plant-based foods which is a part of their daily meal. Vegetarianism by itself is, uh, you know, they're in different categories depending upon a person's choice, his beliefs. So you have lacto-vegetarians, which is the biggest uh, group, uh, which are people who eat plant-based food and at the same time do consume dairy, which is milk, cheese, paneer, dahi, etc. Then you have the lacto-over-vegetarians who, in addition to dairy and plant-based foods, also consume eggs. A new group actually it's not new another group of people called the vegans which are increasing in large numbers these days are people who don't touch any food that comes from an animal source be it milk egg meat fish chicken any kind of flesh as a nutritionist what concerns me most about any food or a diet is its nutritional value vegetarian food is extremely nutritious n number of studies N number of scientific papers have proven that all the things that help protect us against diseases, be it antioxidants, be it fiber, be it minerals and uh, vitamins, and are available to us through plant-based foods. Even the proteins that we get on, from plant-based foods are totally low fat and very low in saturated fats. So they're even better than lean proteins. Uh, these kind of diets we know are very very good for protecting us against heart diseases, against diabetes, uh, blood pressure and against uh, cancers. So uh, eating a vegetarian diet is actually a good way to go. How do we make sure we are uh, getting enough of nutrients? Very simple, put that in your mind, roti, dal, sabzi, dahi. Roti, by roti I mean grains. Try to take uh, whole grains 80% of the time. Of course, you're going to have your pastas and your refined cereals once in a while. That's perfectly all right. So take whole grains. Choose proteins from whole dals. They are better than split dals. Vegetables, that's the only thing we Indians actually eat very well. So eat a good amount of vegetables and pair it up with dahi. So take your plate. One fourth of your plate will have your grains. One fourth will have your proteins, about a palm size uh, quantity. Half your plate will have vegetables. Your uh, dahi or milk will come on the side, depending on what your menu is. And you can finish it off with a fruit. Here's wishing you good health. This is Rupali Datta signing off.